Howdy friends, welcome back to the show. Well, autumn has finally arrived and that means cooler temperatures for the most part across the board, which opens up the opportunities we've all been waiting for through the brutal hot summer, you got it, hiking and overnight camping. Now, as everybody knows, the last couple of years has not really been normal by any means due to the pandemic, travel restrictions and all the other good stuff. So a good share of people ended up not getting the opportunity to go out and enjoy the outdoors the way they're accustomed to. Well, now that things are kind of getting back to normal, we can get about our business enjoying the outdoors again. A lot of you folks out there might be digging through your closet, or your attic, or your basement, or garage and digging out some of that old gear, and to come to find out some of it's missing, or it's in disrepair, or it's outdated. If any of you guys have followed my channel for any time, you'll notice in the last couple years or so, I've been sporting this little Magellan Outdoor Day Pack. It's a little youth size backpack and stuff and it's been great for little micro adventures and going out and doing tarp shelters and you know lunches and all that good stuff and it's great and it's lightweight and micro size however there are limitations i've had which is the size and the lack thereof no chest strap and you just don't have enough to get you by for a few hours during a day hike however Today I'm going to be reviewing a brand new product that I found that I want to share with you will really make you start thinking how much money you need to put out there to have a good time and to make things happen and to get the most bang for your buck. Introducing the all new Outdoor Products Venture Backpack. 17 liter unisex day pack backpack beautifully loaded and equipped with all the extra goodies let's get into it right now. Sweet little backpack comes in right at about 1.11 pounds absolutely no weight at all to it. Let's get into some of the features of this nice little pack. The thing that jumps out at me with this pack is the size of the room and the compartments. We've got one medium sized compartment in the front that has zippers and then we've got a smaller one up top and then we have our main compartment which is in the back which automatically tells me out of the gate I've got lots and lots of room to make it wherever I want to for possibly even an overnight. All right, let's take a look at our front compartment here in our Outdoor Products Adventure Backpack. Nice, easy zip compartment. Lots of room. Got a nice big area open in front here, and I don't know if you can see or not. There's two more little compartments right here, and then another mid-sized compartment. And that's all just in the first zipped pocket that we have on the front of this nice backpack. Next in line is a smaller sized compartment here that's small and it's kind of padded and stuff. Now I'll show you what you can do with that. Not to mention the fact, and this is not advertised really with this backpack, is a larger compartment that sits in the back. Two full-size compartments, but this is actually equipped for a hydration bladder here in the back. And if you look at the bottom of the pack, that's what your little hose would be coming out of. See that right there? So this is actually can be used as a hydration pack on top of that. Let's get into some other really exciting feature this thing has to offer. This cool little day pack actually also comes equipped with several molly straps through here, which is awesome because now I can have other options such as clipping carabiners onto it and hanging things outside of the pack and get me further down the road with less nice equipped with molly straps. Take a look at the sides here. You got two slotted areas, one on each side that can easily carry a beverage, a little canister, a bottle of water, two extra little areas or whatever it is you want to put in there. There are exterior pouches that also have little draw straps to them to keep it tight so nothing will fall out. Not to mention padded back straps. See that? Beautiful. As well as a chest strap that is adjustable with a clip that can also help when it comes to fatigue and weight distribution. All right, let's take a moment and just take a look at what I've been sporting and carrying around for the past two years, the Magellan Outdoor Youth Pack that has no Molly straps, only one little outside deal here, no padded straps or chest straps or nothing like that, compared to the Outdoor Products Venture day pack backpack that is loaded with all of these goodies and look at the size difference between the two it's not even close all right let's take a moment and see how much bang for the buck we got out of this outdoor products venture day pack all right so one of the first modifications i made on the outdoor products venture backpack is my buddy old matt florida boy uh gave me these old molly packs a long time ago and i've utilized them with my molly straps two small little packs 
they're on the outside. They might not be big, but they're enough to hold little things like maybe cream and sugar, uh, some uh, ammunition, whatever else we wanted to. Not to mention the fact, tent stakes that are wrapped up here in the molly straps. You can just load them on up there and none of this stuff is taking up any space inside. Speaking of inside, let's open up and see how much we were able to pack this thing with. Now everything you see me unload from this pack is strictly for video purposes only. You make the best of what works for you. Let's go ahead and get started and open up our big pack. Let me just go show you how much stuff you're able to pack in here. I got a fuel canister. Let's back that up a little bit. Got a little stove. We've got a hammock. All right. Nice. We've got a cream and sugar for coffee. What else we got in here? We got a full micro frying pan with a lid. Not to mention, we have our trusty canteen as well as our full sized canteen cup. This is all fitting just in the large compartment first. What else is up in here? Okay, I've got my hatchet, my little camp axe. We're still in the main compartment here. Look at this. I got an eight by 10 tarp. <laughs> Talk about shelter. Now, if we want to, this is just for video purposes, like I said, I've got a mess tent. Look at that thing. All this stuff is fitting into my main pack. A full thing, a paracord, as well as a collapsible foldable camp stove. That was just what is inside of the large container. Let's move on to the next. Remember I was telling you about that smaller compartment that was up here? Yes, I consider this the gold mine compartment. You can do whatever you want with it, maybe put some car keys in there, medicine, but this will fit a full-sized iPhone cell phone, full size, and it keeps it protected by itself. That's why it was a standalone compartment just for that. Let's open up the next compartment, which is our lower compartment. See what kind of things we have in there. We got a full roll of jute twine. We got a package of ramen noodles. Got some hot sauce. Let's not mention some pepper. My spoon and fork, as well as coffee. All the good stuff, some spam. Remember that little clip that we had inside? Look what it's holding on to. Uh-huh, a P38. Nice. Not to mention a couple packets of grits. So all that room being said and everything, there still was room on both my side compartments for two full bottles of water. Now, how do you like that? All right, well, let's see how that pack feels on our back. Nice padded straps on like the last backpack that I've been running around with in the gentleman. They're just little gunny sack straps. Didn't really work very much when it comes to weight. And a little chest strap. Every little bit helps. Comfortable, rides high. I don't have any fatigue on the bottom end. I can walk and walk and walk. And with this pack only being one pound, 10 pounds, I was easily able to distribute that weight in the back of here, no problem. Oh, did I mention this nice little backpack comes with a lifetime guarantee. All right, time for the million dollar question. How much is it, Tim? Found at my local Walmart, the Outdoor Products Venture 17 liter backpack, $14.97. <laughs> hey, that's gonna do it for this one. Thanks so much for hanging out and watching the video. The Outdoor Products Venture 17 liter unisex backpack. A lot of bang for that buck. Found at your local Walmart for under $15. Go check it out.